Hi, I'm Anne. And I'm Rebecca. And we're going to tell you about birds, specifically cockatiels and parakeets. Parakeets can also be called budgies. Isn't that the cutest name ever? Yeah, but did you know that budgies are also called budgerigogs? Um... Why don't we start with cockatiels? These are cockatiels. Yeah, so cockatiels don't have names like parakeets or budgies or budget cards, but that makes them less confusing. Also... They have mohawks! Woohoo! Mohawk time! Cockatiels are very intelligent. You can teach them how to talk. Cool. This one's Polly. Say hello. And this one is Mr. Brady. A great cockatiel website is www.cockatielcottage.net. They can also be showbirds. Yes, that's a real thing. Sadly, my birds are not showbirds. Cockatiels are nice and friendly in captivity. Let's talk about them in the wild. Wild, they are gray. They either travel in pairs or small flocks. Flocks are groups of birds that travel together and stay together. They need they whistle to alert members in the flock. Cockatiels build their nests as high as six feet up in the trees and near sorts of water. You wouldn't want to get thirsty. That must affect keeping them as pets. The budgies. These are my budgies, Avery and Lake. This is Avery, and this is Lake. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, you nibble me. Aw, cute. Yep. Budgies can also be referred to by other names, such as budgie, well, such as parakeet, budgerigar, or Australian shell parakeet. But did you know that parakeet refers to over 200 species of birds? Budgie refers to this exact species. A good place to learn about budgies is www.budgieplace.com. Cockatiels and parakeets are both small Australian parrots. They're pretty and very, very cute. These two are blue. In the wild, budgies are green to hide from predators. The blue is a result of the mutation of a mutation. Of course, in the wild, it doesn't usually happen because these colored budgies are singled out first by predators and often don't live to breed. However, in captivity, budgie owners love the colors, so pet stores make sure to carry a wide variety of multicolored budgies. You can tell the gender of a parakeet by the color of its sari or his nose, meaning this little part right here. Leek is a boy, and we're pretty sure Avery's a girl, but she's not old enough to tell you. My birds have trimmed wings. On Leek, I did it myself, and on Avery, she got it done at the pet store. Leek could fly yesterday, but I trimmed them. So, no, don't you just walk in. Here are her wings. They're already growing back in, which is weird. These ones down here that are longer, those are secondary flight feathers. I only trimmed the primary flight feathers. And on Avery here, you can see she's got... One of her primaries growing in. She can fly farther than Leek. Here's two of her primaries, and down here, these are her secondaries. It doesn't hurt them getting their wings trimmed. That's like having your hair cut. Yeah. Yeah. The same thing goes for cockatiels. Well, we hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. You should have done the report about me! Roar! Super Bunny Pow! Sorry about that. That was my bunny Elizabeth. As I was saying, we hope you enjoyed the movie. <laughs>